Since 2006, the Confucius Institute has breathed life to the beauty and wonder of Chinese culture here in the Philippines. RCI was established in October of 2006. It was the very first set up here in the Philippines. On October 3, 2006, the Confucius Institute at the Ateneo de Manila University was inaugurated by former Chinese ambassador Li Qinjun and former Ateneo president, Father Bienvenido Nebres. RCI aims to promote uh, Chinese language learning and culture and also knowledge on uh, contemporary China here in the Philippines. In particular, to the people in the mainstream society. Through various programs and activities, the Confucius Institute aims to pave the way for a celebration of Chinese heritage in the country. We strongly believe that uh, mutual understanding between the, our two countries, the Philippines and China, can be enhanced through the learning of each other's language and culture, as well as uh, through people-to-people -people contacts. The Ateneo de Manila University is one of the Philippines' leading universities and is home to the Confucius Institute. Headed by a board of leading experts in the country, the Institute remains highly respected since its birth in 2006. Through their vision and dedication in the past years, the influence of the Institute has become increasingly tangible in the country. Today, the Confucius Institute at the Ateneo de Manila University is found in two locations, Makati and inside the Ateneo de Manila University. In uh, 2010, we moved here uh, to Ma uh, Makati, the central business district in the country. This is where we can attract a lot of professionals and they are our target group for the teaching of uh, Chinese. The Confucius Institute offers an array of Chinese language classes for anyone seeking to learn the native tongue. Uh, so for the corporate Chinese course, we usually start with the organizational structure and then from there we attend trainings about corporate cultures, about task delegation, about financial reports, all of these business aspects of Chinese world. We actually do that. Uh,现在我们的文化课程比较多,呃,学生喜欢的是国画课,还有,呃,书法,太极拳,气功,中国音乐,呃,包括唱歌和古筝教学,呃,另外还有中国手工,比如说中国节啊,剪纸啊,
呃，还有呢，我们为各个学校的学生提供 HSK 考试，呃，夏令营，呃，也提供奖学金，呃呃，推荐优秀的学生到中国去学习汉语。The Confucius Institute at the Ateneo de Manila University allows students to apply for scholarships offered by universities in China. Participants gain a first-hand experience of the country's culture. And deepen their appreciation for it. A total of 17 scholars have been sent to China so far. The institute has a roster of local Chinese and volunteer teachers, dedicated to effectively teaching Mandarin and contributing to the students' knowledge of China. The Ateneo Confucius Institute also contributes to the development of Chinese language education by providing numerous teacher training seminars all over the country. These programs improve the quality of classroom instruction and the language learning experience of thousands of students in the Philippines. Aside from classes. The Confucius Institute supports the academic undertakings of its faculty and student body. In line with the Confucius Institute's thrust of pursuing excellence, its leaders have been recognized for their various achievements. These include the Confucius Institute Individual Performance Award in 2009 and 2010 to Dr. Ellen Palanca, and then Chinese Director Professor Chang Shetao, respectively, and the Confucius Institute Outstanding Contribution Award. To then Chairman of the Board, Father Bienvenido Nebres, in 2011. The presence of Confucius Institute reminds us that we we have neighbors, and that we need to interact、uh, with our neighbors, especially China as well in in this region. It broadens our horizons, it opens our doors, and it also makes us appreciate our being Filipino. Language can be a barrier. <laughs> But language can be a bridge. Words, and that's that's the first thing that Confucius Institute、uh, does is to is to acquaint us with the language. And and in that regard, I think this institute has been a success. Learning the language isn't enough. The Confucius Institute in the Philippines holds several events and activities to celebrate the rich culture of Chinese and Chinese Filipinos alike. The 2014 Spring Festival Chinese Painting Exhibit and Art Workshops were held from January 24 to February 6, 2014. It showcased artworks made by students of its own Chinese painting class and artists from the International Studies for Chinese Arts. The Eighth Spring Film Festival, co-organized with the Ricardo Leong Center for Chinese Studies. Was also held simultaneously. It showcased critically acclaimed films such as *Aftershock* and *1911 Revolution*. The institute also holds other yearly activities during spring festivals and mid-autumn festivals in major shopping centers and various schools. Confucius学院呢，呃，也提供这个各类文化活动，比如说我们在春节、中秋节，呃等等这些中国的传统节日的时候呢，做很多的活动，呃，向大家介绍中国的文化。比如说在春节，我们会举办中国传统美食、包
，呃，我们也做一些呃中国歌曲比赛，呃，比如说呃，去年我们与呃飞华电视台一起合作举办的这个呃菲律宾全国的呃唱歌比赛，呃，这个效果非常好。It is important for our people to know that there is there is life beyond our borders. And that we share a lot of things、uh, with our neighbors. Promoting a foreign culture is not really something that undermines nationalism. In fact, I believe that it even deepens our appreciation of who we are. You get to understand the the language, and then you really、uh, have an epiphany of the the words. I'm discovering new. Uh, and learning more、uh, new vocabulary here in Confucius Institute, it was really explained in detail. I, 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 就是学中文对我来说非常重要，非常就是帮我们在中国的时候啊、呃，跟中国人说话。Truly, the Chinese culture is one of great influence and rich meaning, and the Confucius Institute strives to be the best vehicle in celebrating this. Indeed, since 2006. The Confucius Institute has contributed to bringing the Philippines and China closer together for a bright and harmonious relationship.